Do you have an idea for a mask? No. So, when, Brayden, when you did yours, did you look at the animal masks? What did you look at? I'm Tammy Searle. Um, I teach art at Churchill Junior High School. I think that there's so many things in our world that are art related that we need to, to be aware of, of what's out there, you know, everything from our houses that are built and designed by an artist, by our clothes, you know, everything that we do really has some, some tie back to art and so I think that the kids need to have that awareness. Way to go Logan, way to help. I have students that used to bring me a portfolio and now it's all on their computer, it's all on their, you know, their phone even and, and um, so I think a lot of things that we do, even sharing or inspiration or um, I ask my students to, to take pictures that they use as references occasionally. It's nice that it's their own images and it's always on their phone so um, they have them with them. So I would say technology has made the biggest difference in the arts. Are you up to it? You can do that. Every piece of art that they make expresses who they are. It says a statement about who they who they are. Um, I think I also hope them to give them more confidence in what they're doing. That when they pick up a piece of um, art, or if they pick up a pencil or something, that they're a little more confident in their ability to make it be what their what their mind wants it to be. I have students come in my class and. Um, sometimes they're angry or frustrated and I see them leave and that art has done the magic. It's, it's taken that frustration away. I think we all have a need to have a creative outlet in our lives and I think that also does that.